Hi, I'm Candace from WS Tyler. You're probably watching this video because you think it might be time to replace the upper eccentric disc on your Rotap Civ shaker. In this video, we'll walk you through the signs and give you guidance on how to replace the part. When it comes to the upper eccentric disc, you'll notice you need to repair that part when your Rotap starts to wobble back and forth more than normal. Also, where it's located, you can visually inspect the part in the upper carrying plate to make sure it fits snugly and that there's no worn edges. If you have a situation like this, it's time to replace that part. Replacing the upper eccentric disc. Unplug the machine and remove any sieves or loose items. Remove the pedestal cover from the side of the tower. Remove the hammer and hammer block assembly by removing the bolts located at the bottom of the hammer block and the inside of the tower. Remove the bolt at the top of the main shaft. It is located at the top of the tower near the inside edge. Remove the upper main shaft washer, sheet guard, and rotating guard. Remove the eccentric disc from the upper carrying plate. Set aside the eccentric main shaft key. Place the new eccentric disc into the hole in the upper carrying plate and onto the main shaft. Align and insert the main shaft key into the keyway. Reinstall the rotating guard, sheet guard, and the upper main shaft washer. Finally, reinstall the hammer and hammer block assembly, securing the bolt onto the bottom of the upper block inside of the tower. If you have any questions or concerns about performing the maintenance on your Rotap sieve shaker, you can call us at 1-800-321-6188, email us at info at wstyler.com, or you can fill out the form on the Contact Us page of our website. If you'd like to learn more about our Rotap sieve shakers, we have a learning center that's full of content designed to help you become a particle analysis expert. Just click the link in the video description. To keep up to date on all things WS Tyler, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell next to it. Until next time, I'm Candace. Have a great day.